taking a break from pacing for a little bit. We came somewhere else. I'm not gonna tell you where it is. You might recognize it. But we did meet the property owners. We met the property owners. They just bought it and we got permission to be on it. So there's that. But we're gonna go on an exploratory adventure today and I'm not gonna tell you what we're looking for until we find it. That way you'll be just as surprised as we are. So this is kind of the vein here. Some water right there. Kind of going through the rocks. Trying to find some solid stuff. Substance. Yeah. Yeah. Just the surface stuff still looks cool, man. Maybe do a little bit more exploring. I don't know. I kind of feel like we should walk up the river a little bit more. And see what's up there. From this side, right? Or the other side, whichever side. This is about as far as I've ever been. <laughs> kind of curious as to uh, what is further down. Me too. Let's do it. Like this way. All right, let's do it. I've never been down there either. We're gonna go down here behind us, but I'm about to fall over because I'm teetering on this stupid fucking rock. All right, we'll do that. We're gonna go down there and see if we can't find anything down there. One good thing about coming down the hill is these pieces have way more blue in them than they do other colors. I don't know if you can see that very well, but they're a lot better. Yeah, they're a lot better on this side. Much more solid. That looks so pretty through the phone. <laughs> Usually the phone is the terrible. I know. Because now I don't have any. Alright. There's another cool little piece there. Anyways. Uh, let's continue down. Kind of getting rained on. I think we're gonna find a new spot. This spot has been really played out. This has been hit hard. <laughs> so we're gonna drive along and find a new area. I think we're gonna to try to get below one of these mines. You can kind of see them over here. 
and the hill in the distance back over yeah, yonder. All mines back there. So if we can get up in there, or not up in there, but down at the base of those hills. Yeah, we can get to the base of these hills so you can see that's all mined out. So maybe we can get down to the bottom of those and find some cool stuff, man. Some cool rocks. So that is the plan. I'm just waiting for Chris. He took a different path. He's, I don't know, out there somewhere on his way, I hope. I haven't heard anything yet. So as long as there's no screaming, it's all good. No news is good news, right? Sometimes. Chris said he's onto something. So we're trying to find him. I'm not sure where he's at, but we'll find him. There he is. Hello, Prospector! <laughs> All right, well, we got a little bit of a walk to get over there. So, here we go. Oh, we're gonna start it off at a run, too. Nice, all right. All right, when I get over there, I'll come back on and show you what Chris has found. Sounds like he's found something good. Whoa, all right. We're close. We're close now. There he is. Just pick up this hill. Ooh. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I'm talking to myself. And the millions of people on the YouTubes. All of the YouTubes. All of it. Even the weird ones are watching. That is all of them. <laughs> so he's found thicker pieces of azurite that are thicker. <laughs> <laughs> Peek inside Chris's bag. Oh, there's some more coming in. There's a lot of color on the ground here. Oh, yeah. You can't find something interesting. Show you. Otherwise, it's gonna be a real quick video. Well, we got rained out of our other spot, so we came and stopped by a mine, and they told us to come down over here. And this is what we find: just a sea of white. Kind of crazy. All right. I have never seen anything like this. Look what we're driving into here right now. This is insane. Now look up that way, white down. Holy cow, that's a, that's a huge tailings pile. Kind of cool we were able to come back here. See the pond down in there. This is kind of cool back in here. Water levels at 3,500 feet. Dang. Okay. 
cross. So we went driving around through the mountains and we've actually found a really nice, really pretty camping spot. Kind of an oasis out here in the middle of the mountains, right next to a stream in some trees. This is a really nice area. We're in gold country, copper country, silver country. This could be a nice spot for a dirty dog camp out, 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 camp out session. That's what I'm trying to say. This would be a nice spot for a dirty dog camp out. Yes, sir. Even in the middle of summertime, it'd be nice out here. We got the stream down here. It's fairly clean where it's running in the middle down here. There's a couple mines up the road, so there's plenty of rocks to rock hound. There's Chris's in the truck. There's always Chris's everywhere we go. This is a really nice, cool little spot. Little campfire there. Another little campfire spot right up, like right back in there. And then there's another spot right over there. Yeah. If we find some cool stuff, I think we'll do a camp outing down here. This is, I like this area. All right, let's explore. Well, there's probably gold down here. Chris has found a huge piece of obsidian. Really cool agate, some cool jasper. There's a lot of neat rocks down here. So this is definitely a good spot to camp and rock hunt and relax. Yeah, this is tranquility at its finest for sure for the middle of Arizona desert. Quite peaceful. Let's see where, where, where'd, where'd Chris go? There's that big piece of obsidian Chris found. It's ginormous. Let's go see those other rock. So this uh, is definitely the find of the day. This is nice, yeah. It's big and it's heavy. And look it's at it. This one. Look at it. Oh my god, look at that one. That is cool. Yeah, it's almost like a pastelite jasper, but this thing is amazing. Let me zoom in a little bit, see if you can see some of the detail in this. This is freaking cool, man. Oh yeah, there's another one. Look at that. Definitely some neat rocks down here. The slices, these are gonna be. The slices. Oh, Chris's pile. Oh, I'm glad there's some nice cool water down here and some shade and lizards. Splash some of this in my face here. Oh yeah, look at that nice clean water. Oh man, that feels good. He wants all the rocks. <laughs> yeah? Let's go check it out. That's a cool one. Rocks. We found some pretty cool rocks in there. I got a bag of, I'm taking home a bag of dirt to pan out. I don't know how much, if anything, will be in there. It was just kind of all off the top out of one spot that looked okay. But we'll see what happens. We got some cool rocks here. Oh, yeah. But those will all have to be cut open and cleaned up pretty good. Here comes Chris. 
I think we're going to head to the other side of the mine here and see what we can find over there. And here's the rest of the camp spot. It's, <laughs> it's big, man. It's a good camp spot. Get a few people out here. Get some obsidian, some agates, some jasper. Maybe some gold, we'll have to test that. But very good spot for a camping trip. Shade, trees, river, rocks. Who could ask for anything more? Here we are, come up the road. It's the other side of the bridge, quote unquote. A lot of cool stuff up here. Of course, it's fine stuff. There's a lot of like really crappy obsidian up here like that. That guy there. There's a bunch of it. There's fossils. Huh? What? Oh, this is actually real nice. Well, we're going to come back and see. You found a piece of old opalescent mercury glass. Kind of cool. In the sun, they shine like greens and blues and stuff. So we just got back into town. Chris hosed some of this stuff off. Man, look at that blue that comes out on this. Look at that. That is insane. Look at that. Holy cow. It's got some color. That is awesome. Guys, not sure what it is, but they're cool. That's probably my favorite. This is neat too. Yep. So the next thing is I gotta go home and wash mine off <laughs> and show you those. But it was a good day, relaxing day. We found some new spots, some promising gold areas. So. Oh yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to uh, going back to gold. Yeah, the gold will be fun. So, I'll go home and wash my rocks off, show you, show you those, and then until next time, Dirty Dog Prospecting, like and subscribe.